all right my dearest friends welcome welcome back so we'll just finish um what we started before i have a little bit of left but we have a baggie of like bits and bobs we'll uh, go through it so right here we have a single earrings that we found so far right here we have our dysfunctional family with romeo uh juliet here she is, upside down. They probably were partying last night. Juliet. This is a butler and two freeloaders. We don't, um, we haven't named them yet. They just moved in and not moving out. All right, so right here we have our single earrings. I just came back from a jeweler. They put a battery in Movado watch and they replaced the leather band. It is new, perfect, watch is working, there is, of course, scratches, a little bit scratches on the face um, of the watch, because it's used, it's not new, it can be polished, I do believe, but the watch is working, band is new, if, if anyone is interested, please let me know, all working, all in good condition, a little bit of scratches on the face, like, you can see, like, a little bit scratches right if not interested if no one's interested i just leave it for myself okay all right let's get going we have a little bit of chains left here and then we'll move to the beads and bobs um if you like what you see and you would like to purchase it please email me at yourvintagebeauties at gmail.com with a timestamp and the brief description of the item and i'll give you the price also consider subscribing i'd like to have you other part of the family and it will help me to promote my channel at the same time as of right now um if you guys are interested about my job search i am i do have interviews you know the ghosting and people dropping off the ball is is horrendous right now uh, recruiters don't return phone calls they excite you about the opportunity then they never call you back and you have to like it, it's it's horrible but i'm having interviews i'm having hopes i've never been without a job for that long it's been well, like two three months three months well two like officially and three unofficially because uh, they told me that my position was eliminated a month before they actually eliminated me but so it's three months it's it's horrendous i've never been out of job for three months in my entire life never ever so it's i'm a little bit kind of nervous freaking out i'm panicking but i left it up to the god and god will help god will knows in in, in god's speed so all right so first we have this bib style gold tone necklace uh gold tone wore off and i think i'm gonna put it in um in the craft pile red cross pin I'm gonna have to check it for sometimes they might be gold what do we have here I have no idea what it says let's take a look I don't know I don't know and there is some kind of a yuck right here so i'll need to wash it off and see just in case because old gold sometimes can have this kind of a tea color all right right here we have a gold tone necklace we have a lobster and right here we have a tag and it says luna luna Morte or Norte? Luna Luna Norte. I've never heard of Luna Norte. And okay, we need to turn on Presidium. Right here we have little quartz, a little bit iridescent, natural quartz, tiny, tiny towers. Oh, I was off screen. Let me see. It's not magnetic. I don't see any stamps or anything. I can test it. No stamps on this side. No stamps on this. No stamps on this. Okay. 
there are no stamps so we will consider it's gold tone with little three little towers of um, iridescent quartz okay right here we have probably necklace silver tone at um, lobster claws right here on the bottom then we have a drop chain and we have a little silver tone butterfly i'm not sure it's maybe necklace maybe something else i don't know it's like this with the little butterfly silver tone something interesting okay let's take a look at this necklace first so we have silver tone chain little knotted okay we have a little taggy next to the closure it says loft we have a loft necklace and we have a really tiny rhinestone a little bit of opalescent It's glass, little glass opalescent rhinestone, very pretty necklace. Next, another silver tone necklace. We have a hook as a closure, little tag. It says MM, MM, and the pendant is this, what do you call it? A cone with rhinestones in front. Okay, also very pretty, great condition by the way. We have a lot of little tiny things. All right, so we have silver, yep, a silver necklace, chain. Right here it says Italy 925, uh, yeah, Italy 925, and then we have a pendant which is lapis you can hear it right here it's lapis lazuli very pretty lapis lazuli pendant nice silver item uh, some type of pendant um, I'm gonna I'm putting this to craft bracelet most likely silver Let's take a look. Yeah, right there it says 925 right here. 925. We have little tiny puffy hearts bracelet. It's slightly magnetic, so I think it might be just closure that's silver. Let's double check. Or it might be heavily plated. Hmm. Do you see the line? A red line? And this bubble. I don't like when bubbles happen. We have a red line right here. So we have silver. And I scratched pretty nicely. So unless it's really heavily plated. Okay, the size of this bracelet is seven. Very pretty silver. Oh, I put some oil on my hands with little puffy hearts. Pretty bracelet. Okay. Oh, this is pretty. But... Uh-oh, this is also silver, but I will need to untie this. This is interesting. I'm probably gonna ask you guys help in identifying. Okay, 
Where is my poker? Pokey pokey. Loosen up. So many knots. Hopefully, whoever likes me untangling stuff, enjoy. You know, it's always 50-50. Some's gonna say I love it, some's gonna say I hate it, and I'm leaving, goodbye, can't handle it anymore. <laughs> it's always so funny. Before the channel, when I would read comments from other people, I would be... I would not really pay attention now that I have my own channel and I read comments so so opposite so like it's so interesting you know in me being kind of like ex people pleaser I want to please everyone and then I sit down and it's like how can I please everyone some people want completely opposite of the other ones so I usually go by my subscribers that's been with me for a long time whatever they want I do it because I know you guys are very loyal and usually my like subscribers that are I'm probably gonna have to pause it guys it's taking too long usually my subscribers are the most kind people you know what I'm saying people that have been with me forever since the very beginning they're the most kind people always who are just for one time you know coming they're always the most rude and the most like critical and judgmental my subscribers usually say that's been with me for oh we don't care we're a family you know do whatever we like it we're here just to like hang out you know and so interesting i don't take it personally you know i'm just usually like wow it must be miserable to be you you know what i'm saying all right, it's taking forever. Give me a second. All right, almost there. Oh, you know, the funny thing is sometimes when I do this untangling, I talk to you just to tell you what's going on and stuff like that. The funny part is that people who never come back, they just come for one time. They'll leave comments like, you're talking too much. Just show your stuff and, and you don't need to, to, to talk too much. Like, uh, hello? Like... You, you never come back. What does it to you? Right? Okay, so we have a silver chain right here. And we have this pendant. What do you think it is? I, I see this little tiny like evil eye protection. Maybe it's like a Hebrew letter. Or maybe it's a number one. This is very interesting. I doubt I'll be able to check what type of rhinestones we have. I'll, I'll try the top ones. Above like an eye. Letter. I don't know what type of letter. Or what is it? Letter or anything? It's it's CZs, guys. They are CZs. Very pretty. If you guys can help me out and understand what this what this is, I would appreciate it. But this is silver. Okay. All right. Next. Oh, look at this. We have a silver. I think I just recently sold a chain like this. Whoever I sold the chain to, if you want bracelet let me know it's silver there we go silver italy bracelet and it's size oh it's probably anklet guys it's size nine it says nine it could be an anklet or a big bracelet next silver town chain very pretty very clean it's brighten look at this it's brighten here we go letter b we have a specific lobster claw with the heart and we have a very pretty uh sea star with um or starfish with uh pearl very very pretty very clean look at this not tarnished at all oh two-sided like a real starfish we got a Brighton. Love Brighton. Love it. 
uh, another bracelet or huh or anklet interesting I see some type of uh, stampy let's take a look we have look at this what does it say I don't know Oh, gold field something gold field 120th see and on this side it says gf so we have a gold field bracelet or anklet probably bracelet let's see nope also could be anklet size nine size nine very pretty i don't know what was hanging here but gold field with this like uh, small discs like this anklet or a big bracelet cool stuff oh let's see Ooh, what's going on oh my goodness There's something very dainty okay let's take a look at this one first so we have an open dove this one is asymmetrical necklace where is my neck So I'm going to close it, not including the, not including the extender. Come on. Okay. So see, it's kind of on the side. Very pretty on the side. The taggy right here says K18. I don't know if it's 18 carats, guys. I really don't, but it might be. Let's see. I, I can test if you want me to. I don't see any stamps right here. None whatsoever. And... Hold on. I think it's slightly, like very, very you know slightly magnetic i i kind of scared to test because it's very dainty it's very dainty but it's very pretty i will probably test it guys because we can do it later on if you want if we we're going to be below one hour i'll do it i'll put it aside right now <clears throat> what do we have here we have some kind of a necklace oxidized with free hair oxidized chain and we have um mickey it says disney on the back uh, the chain is probably you know what craft this is craft this is very interesting necklace so the chain is very dainty very 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 dainty i'm in afraid i'm even afraid untying it it's very knotted very knotted probably not gonna do it right now it is let's see if it's silver or anything back and forth you guys it is 585 it's 14 karat gold okay so we have a 14 karat gold chain which is very dainty see how dainty it is and we have this pendant this is most likely CZ. I do have see some kind of a stamp. It actually goes way beyond glass. It's kind of a tourmaline line. Yeah, it's kind of in the middle of 
interesting kind of middle of tanzanite and aqua line but it is clear rhinestone it is very pretty i will do my best I, I will undo it i'll spend some time on doing it when when after i will do a good job no worries it's very pretty very pretty 14 karat gold that's nice Okay, putting it aside also moving along we have a single earring I don't think I have another one like this aside yeah just this little tiny pile probably gonna take us a long time all right let's do this one stretchy bracelet it says made with love peace sign right here as a shell stretch is okay shell and um, pearls Let's see, faux pearls. Nice. Oh, I want to take a look at this one. This is pretty. Ooh, it says S25 on the back of this pendant. See, it says S25 or S925. It's most likely plated rose gold plated uh, the closure is what's happening here oh, okay the closure is kind of a hook right here we have another 925 it's rose gold with this very pretty pendant it has a heart it does a rhinestone and one kind of a rhinestone in the middle all like shimmery let me see what do we have here it's a cz yeah we have cz's here it is very 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 pretty necklace on a rose gold kind of a plated very pretty very clean gorgeous gorgeous necklace Oh, another one, a red cross. See, it, it has something on the back. Oh, I don't even know if I'll be able to read. Yeah, I'll read it later. By the way, I just took all my scrap, silver and gold scrap. I had like a baggie like this, Ziploc baggie. Uh, when they were fish, uh, when she was doing my watch, I gave her the scraps, and it came up to be like seven hundred dollars of scraps. I couldn't believe it. Anyway, um, right here we have probably a necklace, a silver tone, lobster claw. I have no idea what this is. Kind of like this. Yeah, probably like a choker necklace. <gasps> Ooh, this is pretty. Let me see. Oh, this is so pretty, guys. Love it. Let's open it. Because they're tied. So many knots. It's probably gold tone. Well, not probably, most likely. Let's see. It's two stranded. Let's see if they're uh, layered. Okay, this one. Okay, here we go. Yeah, two stranded gold tone layered and layered and gorgeous look at this so what do we have on one layer on one layer we have this conch shell gold tone conch shell very pretty very pretty and right here we have like a baloney shell pendant look how gorgeous it is let's see what it says if there yeah so let's see what it says here nothing it says nothing there is no stamps 
yeah it's just yeah it's gold tone but it's very very pretty very very pretty it's the most gorgeousness all right oh here we go second earring these are post earrings kind of like lilies oh there is something stamped let's see avon so we have avon earrings silver tone pose with faux pearls very pretty very pretty okay nice now i would like to take this one because it's, it looks like it's multi-stranded and it gets deeper and deeper tangled see This, uh, these fine um, chains are hopeful. Usually if it's really fine chain, it's probably some precious metal. Somebody's gonna like, you're talking too much. They're gonna put comments, yeah, they're talking too much. Yes, I love to talk. I wanna talk to you. I want to do life, you know. I just want to go do like maybe YouTube live or TikTok live just to see it and unbag. Oh, interesting. I'm gonna untangle and then we'll we'll take a look because I just is this one? Yeah, I think this is this is just one. See, when I am multi-stranded, they're like tingle on themselves. Hold on. Where is... How does it work? There we go. Like this. Oh, wow. I don't know this is absolutely frustrating so these are multi strands they need to be untangled because they tangled on themselves but as you can see we have a long gold tone strand a multi chain very pretty there are no stamps or anything it's magnetic slightly and right here we have a very pretty pendant with a teardrop glass we have glass rhinestones. It's really, really pretty. See, it's really pretty pendant on a very long multi-strand chain. Right here we have a silver tone necklace. It is Claire's, but it's very pretty. Look, it kind of has a faux cameo. Very pretty with some tassel -y thing. I usually don't keep Claire's, but this one is really pretty. Let's take a look at this one. We have gold tone chain with this gold tone heart, and it does have kind of oblong rhinestones. Let's see if we have any stamps. I think we have something not quite sure right there on the on top see it says oh it says 10k g plus um i don't know what g plus means 10k g plus and right here we have see this kind of a they're not circle rhinestones let's take a look my goodness they're diamonds guys Usually if it's diamonds or something very cool, I will show you. Okay, so they're kind of like patches. There are some right here, some right here, some right here, and some right here. So look at this. So we'll try to get to the big ones. See, we have diamonds. Let's see if I try to get here. Yep. 
diamonds nice we have very interesting diamonds see they're not um oh and right here there's big ones right here let's see here we go see there are a lot of diamonds let me see if i can there we go nice very nice so the chain's probably gold too not not sure i don't see anything here oh i don't see anything here interesting haven't seen any stamps on uh, chain but you guys always see it before me maybe not gold chain no not magnetic probably gold very pretty 10 carat heart with diamonds very unusual the size and shape of the diamonds are very unusual all right so we have silver tone chain uh, lobster claw with this tower oh look like i'm test. let's see yeah we have some quartz um, amethyst and all type of different quartz and on this tower um, this might be silver chain no I don't think so yeah chains not but it's very pretty tower all right we're almost done with this we have a bracelet right here gold tone American something american showcase we have a gold tone chain bracelet slightly magnetic very good condition i have a taiwan heart brooch um kind of old <clears throat> antique gold tone with faux pearl brooch uh, we have silver tone chain yep silver tone chain with a very pretty feather a pendant i need to replace rhinestone right here i do have that type of size but because it's very pretty very uh, sparkly feather pendant very pretty okay so what do we have here uh, gold tone chain lobster claw faux pearls yeah chain is not magnetic um, extender is very magnetic chain itself is not it's very pretty very dainty very gentle kind of a choker or color necklace right All right, and the last necklace that we have is multi-stranded. How many strands we have here? A lot. Uh, black gunmetal color closure, lobster claw. We have an extender. There is no name, no tags, and it's very pretty. It's seed beads. We have laces, and we have we have glass beads. Yeah, we have glass beads it's very pretty i like it okay let's get to this bag we have all rings and type of stuff here oh look at this really pretty silver tone key probably pendant or something very pretty very small and dainty what else I don't know what this is um some type of keychain or something with i don't know look some type of thing i have no idea what this is i have a silver tone crucifix magnetic probably a pendant if you want chain for it i have here's another pendant probably we're gonna put it in craft silver tone 
for that. Oh, this is really pretty. I, I might find a chain for this one. It is jade, pink jade heart. Very, oh, you can't even see it on my hand. Very pretty jade heart. Probably like a three quarters of an inch size. We have um, Berkman's Place pin. We have an earring. Oh, here it is. Here is an earring made. Post for pearls in a very good condition. I'll add back into this one. Really good for pearls. What else? Right here we have another pendant. United States of America, it says. Right here it says American Indian Relief Council 2013. Uh, oh, okay. Also, gonna put it in craft if you need it. Let me know. Have no idea what this is. Fell off of something. Another, another pendant gold tone. Uh, also, gonna put it in craft because it's all yeah it's all i don't know what else another pendant oh this is literally like a baby gerber probably silver yeah i think it says sterling right there on the bottom it says sterling if you guys want this one let me know if you want a chain for it also let me know I can find chain for it. What else? Puffy heart, gold tone charm. Not magnetic, interesting. Um, we have cross, um, very dainty cross. Let's take a look. Nine, nine two five, silver cross. Of course, for sale, probably an inch or a quarter of an inch. Not quarter, so a three quarters of an inch, probably. What else? Oh, look at this. We found earring. Here we go. This one's a silver. I really like this a kind of a podium for a rhinestone. I don't remember what do we have here. Oh, we have spinel. We have spinel here, and the earring itself, I don't remember. It's either silver or something else. If you want me to test, I will, but the stones here are spinels. Clear spinels. Here we go. Posts. Very pretty posts. Look at this profile. Absolutely love it. Okay. Another realtor pin. Uh, gold tone giraffe pin. Yeah, I just need to find the closure. Giraffes. Two giraffes pin. There are more pins. Girls club. And American flag. Yeah, Boys and Girls Club and American Flag. Um, pendant, Silver Tone, Gold Tone. Not magnetic, but... Oh, come on. This is bizarre. Is this diamond? It went to white sapphire, this little stone right here. See, the little stone went to sapphire. This is interesting. I don't see any stamps or anything. It went to a diamond now. <laughs> this is very, this is very bizarre. Let me guys know. I don't see any stamps. I can test it, but... Let's see, not even inside of the bale. Huh, interesting. 
Okay, let's see what else we have. Oh, here is another, another pendant. Oh, this might be silver. What does it say? It says 925 as P2 as 925L. And let's see what kind of stone this is. It's a little bit blue, purple. Hmm. It's in the middle of tourmaline line. Maybe it's iolite. Look at this. See, kind of a purplish, bluish, purplish color. It kind of iolite line. Interesting pendant. Let me know if you want to change for this one. Uh, we have another pendant, kind of a gold tone. Not magnetic. I can test it for gold, but it's kind of like a saint or something. Or Virgin Mary or something. Let's see. Here I have a second post. Silver tone knot, knotted earring. It says Monet, but I'm not sure, it's just a closure right here. Silver tone knotted posts. Silver tone butterfly earring size. Wait, did I say earring? Ring. Size seven. It's silver tone silver tone but it's very pretty very pretty butterfly um, gold tone ring with the enameled right here size 7 I don't see any stamps or names on the back it's very pretty size 7 ring piece all kind of look it's all kind of screwed up Uh, I'll give it the size, but see, it's kind of like weird, not straight. Size 9. Um, bronzy color owl pendant or charm fill off of some, some something. Um, another. This one probably uh, fill off of Brighton necklace or something. It looks kind of like it. Uh, let me know if you want this one. Very pretty. Hard. Copper color ring. I don't know if I'm going to put it. I think I'm going to put it to craft. It's five and a half. Uh, there are a lot of rhinestones that are missing. So I'm probably going to put this one to craft. Let's see. If the, they're size six. In the back but I think it's five and a half mostly okay uh, two colored uh, puzzle ring two gold tone one silver tone size seven magnetic size seven very pretty though clean silver tone ring Huh, maybe silver. Yeah, it is silver. I see a 925 stamp right here on the back. Where is it? I just saw it. Right here somewhere. Hold on. I'll find it. I just saw it. Right here. 9 to 5, something else. Yeah. Alright, so we have, I think, rhinestones here, right? What do you think? Yeah, we have rhinestones. They're CZs. Little tiny CZs on this band. Let's see what size. Size 7, silver band with uh, rhinestones. Second earring, gold tone dingle, earring post, dingles with the, uh, oh, let's see. I think they're full pearls. Yeah, they're full, full pearls. Here we go. Gold tone post, dingles, 
pretty earrings. Oh, this is pretty. Might be silver. Let's take a look. First of all, size six and a half. Also goes above glass, middle tourmaline line, maybe CZs. Probably silver. I just don't know where the stamp is. I can't see the stamp. If you need me to test it, I will test it. Okay. There we go. Right here we have um, abalone. Most like, oh, it is hmm, interesting. Is this? Is this like a, what is it? What kind of stamp is this? At first I was like, is it a dog? It's, yeah, some kind of strange stamp. I don't have anything else. This ring is size seven. It has hearts and abalone not magnetic ask me to test for silver i will i just am trying because we have a lot of rings here this is some kind of a this one goes to craft gold tone let me get this ones to get all together Okay, so right here we have a few gold tone bands, a gold tone and silver tone bands, different uh, variety of sizes. Yeah, gold tone and silver tone, real tiny narrow bands. I have like a chain ring, this one is silver. Right there we have 9 to 5 stamp and this band is seven and a half very pretty kind of a chain band uh, we have something broken silver tone piece craft I have two moose gold tone pin I have kind of a gold tone nugget imitation um it's not magnetic uh, pendant i have a real pearl pendant very pretty if you need chain for this i'll let me know um push pin faux pearl um i have a interesting ring size eight eight and a quarter magnetic we have like a gold tone heart and rhinestones around it cz's uh cz's size eight and a quarter uh, this one is um, probably toe ring it goes to craft oh it was earring like this but it got broken so this two going to craft very pretty flower probably i will test it for silver uh, pendant i will put a jump ring and if you want i can give you a chain for this one very pretty flower what else rose gold tone ring with rhinestones size eight Second earring right here, bronzy color with faux pearls, post earrings. Another kind of a pin. A silvery tone ring with pink enamel. This band is size six. There is something stamped inside. It says China 316 LAV, nothing else. Right here, pink enamel. 
band six and a half gold tone wavy ring size nine and a half with rhinestones glass rhinestones nine and a half probably a thumb ring a silver tone ring with glass it's very lightweight very lightweight gold to oh it's interesting let's see probably cz Yeah, it's probably CZs. So what we have here is a ring that says, let's see, Blanca something, 925, is it? I have no idea what it says. Something blank, Blanca. size it says seven huh it's magnetic okay it's magnetic okay pretty ring silver tone wrap around ring magnetic magnetic size eight silver tone this one's probably silver, but it's not, uh, look, it's, yeah, it's all, I don't know what this is, craft, rose gold, muted rose gold with a bow, size 8, size 8, glass rose gold not magnetic I don't see anything I don't see any stamps something right there but I don't think it's a stamp yeah it's a scratch yeah it's probably gold tone just gold tone with a bow um, another band not magnetic Gold, uh, glass rhinestones size eight and a quarter silver tone uh, silver tone open open ring size seven and three quarters it's like this see open ring open ring silver tone band Seven silver tone, uh, silver earring right here. Second post, uh, hearts, very pretty hearts. Bronzy color. This one goes to craft ring. Seven uh, has a lot of wear on it. Um, I think this one is, yeah, this one is a mood ring. I can see it's changing size seven mood ring. Uh, silver tone. Rhinestones. I'm probably going to put it to craft too much wear. It might be something else. I have some kind of, I see some kind of stamp right there, but no, I think it's, yeah, I don't know, craft silver tone with faux stone, size seven and a half, another real estate or something pin, gold tone ring. Have scratches inside nothing else I don't see any stamps 
it's not magnetic I will test it just in case let me know if you want to know and right here we have glass rhinestones size six and three quarters six and three quarters okay silver tone band maybe silver yeah maybe silver band yeah it is yeah it says 925 right there on the back silver band size eight eight and a quarter probably wedding band um gold tone wedding band looks like wedding band i will test it size eight eight and a quarter i don't see anything but i will look more specifically it's not magnetic yeah little band uh, gold tone band uh, double band one size has rhinestones one doesn't size nine I don't see any stamps there we go double band I don't know what this is probably silver rain very interesting artisan piece size six I will test it oh, I'm kind of curious looks like artisan piece yeah it's silver guys I think it's silver oh wait what no not silver this one's not silver okay but it's still very pretty another gold tone band with rhinestones size 8 uh, another band this one might be silver but not quite sure yet with CZs size 6 and 3 quarters 6 and a half a uh, little misshapen another band this one is silver very small kind of dainty seven and a quarter ring and right here on the top is like a paw i not I, I don't see a stamp yet oh right there nine to five here we go okay and the last thing that we have is very pretty um this one's also usually silver i don't know what these are they're like see like you can you can pull it these are usually silver and right there we have some stamp it says sterling and we have um, rhinestones and the pearl on this one I think the rhinestones are marcasites yeah they're marcasites and we have a little blue pearl those are pretty expensive thingies Whew. all right my friends we did it we made it thank you so much for being with me we did it let me know if you liked it or not not many items but there were a lot of bits and bobs okay whatever you want me to test i will test uh, don't forget to subscribe it really helps me to promote my channel and um leave me a comment leave me a like if you think i deserve it and i will see you next time guys take care Bye bye